We're here, you guys, at Checkers in Hickory, North Carolina, checking out two new offerings, their crispy mushroom steak burger and also the new Philly cheese steak burger here on another Fast Food Pit Stops. Let's go. Welcome back, everybody, to an all-new Fast Food Pit Stops. I'm your host, Justin. I'm here checking out Checkers in Hickory, North Carolina. Of course, Checkers and Rally's, same company, sort of like Hardee's and Carl's Jr. Two of their brand new burgers they just dropped, their bacon and crispy mushroom steak <laughs> burger. It's a mouthful, and I'm expecting it to be. And also their bacon Philly cheesesteak burger. Now, of course, these are also available in their regular uh, non-bacon versions, but who wants to drive as far as I did and not go for the bacon? So two for five dollars, uh, or you can get either one of them, make it a combo for five dollars. Now the bacon and crispy mushroom steak burger sounds absolutely fantastic. What they've done is they've taken their world famous Checkers french fries, which I know several of you have had. They had batter dipped the mushrooms in the same batter and recipe and fried them alongside with their fries. So you're getting that nice seasoned, uh, crispy, super battered up mushroom effect going on on this burger. And the uh, other one is their new uh, bacon Philly cheesesteak burger, which looks like it's exactly the same as the crispy mushroom uh, version of this, just 86 the mushrooms. So I'm expecting these both to be absolutely fantastic, well worth the drive, well worth the five bucks. Let's get it started. We're gonna go ahead and unwrap. I'm not sure which one I got here, but we're gonna take a look. Look at that pretty Kaiser roll here. Now this, okay, this is the one I wanted it to be. Perfect. This is the crispy mushroom version uh, with bacon. And oh, they forgot the bacon. Oh no. Oh no. We got to check the other one real quick, you guys. Oh, okay. So they put bacon. <laughs> they stuck bacon on one of these. Let's see what they did here to me. All right. Well, this will give you guys a good chance to check it out. This is the bacon uh, Philly cheesesteak version here. And obviously you can see all the nice bacon here on this. Look at that. Wow, these are full strips of bacon here. What I'm gonna do here in this case, since I'm already in the car, I think I'm gonna just take one of these pieces of bacon, stick it on the uh, the mushroom version of this. You guys see any, uh, any bacon? No? But you do see the uh, crispy mushrooms here, right? Four of these things, and you can see these things are batter fried, just like Checkers French fries. They look absolutely fantastic. Got the grilled onions going on, got the red onion in there. There's like a, a seasoned mayonnaise here as well. And of course you got your Swiss cheese. Check that out, huh? And of course the main part of this is gonna be the steak. It's kind of that shaved uh, steak here, you can see. Looks real good, right? And then you have your uh, beef patty. So we got the beef, we got the steak, we got the mayo, we got the cheese, we got the onions, we got the mushrooms, but we don't have the bacon, <laughs> but we're about to. I'm gonna steal a piece of this uh, great looking bacon here off of the Philly cheesesteak version of that. A Little bit of roadside surgery here. Bacon and crispy mushroom steak burger at Checkers. Mm. Oh man, it's that good. Man, mm. that bacon was as good as it looked. It has been a long time since I've had a Checkers Burger. I wish that they had more of these available in North Carolina. They've closed several of their locations here, and that's why I had to drive quite a distance. There's only a few of these left in the state. I don't know why, because their burgers are really great. Look at that. Hmm? That looks good. You can see all the layers there. You've got the beef patty. You've got kind of that shaved, that Philly steak thing going on. Of course, the cheese, the uh, battered mushrooms here. Look at this. I just got to take one of these for the team. It tastes like a really big Checkers French fry. It's absolutely fantastic. Look at that, the bread, that nice Kaiser roll, real soft, super fire, you guys. Another bite. Mm. It has a really great flavor to it. That seasoned mayonnaise just gives it, you know, a little bit of a kick there. Look, you know, you don't get that overwhelming sensation of just mayonnaise and meat. That seasoned mayonnaise is fantastic. Let's take another look at that. You can already see, you know, of course, there's seasoning from the patty. You can see a little piece of steak there. In all, this is a really good burger. There's the uh, seasoned mayo. It's on the top and on the bottom. You got a lot of onions. You got a lot of beef going on. Of course, the bacon, I amped up a little bit there. And the uh, those breaded mushrooms, wow. Mm. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. This thing 
is super seasoned up. You know, they're using the, the batter dipped mushrooms on that, which are already heavily seasoned with that, that checkers french fry seasoning. You've got the seasoned mayonnaise, and of course they put seasoning on their meat, you know, so the, the Philly cheesesteak and also the burger patty are all seasoned up. So this thing honestly is a mouthful of flavor. I would say it has a real uh, heavy, sort of like a peppery flavor to it. There's a lot of pepper going on in here. I mean, you can't mistake but, but see it. Still that pepper, you can definitely taste it. Mm. We're gonna do a last bite, big bite, of the bacon and crunchy mushroom steak burger here at Checkers. Mm. Really good. So of course the bacon Philly cheese steak burger has exactly the same uh, ingredients as the uh, crispy mushroom one that I just sampled for you. Of course, sands the mushrooms. Pretty, probably pretty predictable taste here. I'm expecting it to be absolutely fantastic. Let's go ahead and wrap this thing up in a nice bun and get started on it here. Oh man, it just smells good. Just that Checkers Burger smell. I don't know how they do it. You know, the different burger chains all have a real distinct flavor, taste, texture, smell. And it has been a while since I've had a Checkers Burger. Here we go. First bite, big bite. Mm, all those bacon crumbles in there. Got that heavy meat flavor once again. Look at that. Look at that bacon, right? Makes me sort of wish they had actually put bacon on the first one because I would have had double the bacon that I have on this one but it's still fantastic the way it is. Mm. Once again, you got that soft bun, the Swiss cheese, the two types of meats here. You got the burger patty, you got the nice shaved Philly steak, you got the onions, that mayo, and the bacon, of course, just tops it off. Wow, look at the meat. Look at the layers of meat there. Not too bad, not bad for $2.50. Mm. How good, right? Nothing better than a, just a really good burger. You know what I'm talking about? And these are no exception. Mm. I don't know if maybe it's just my mouth is too big, my appetite's too big, or these things have just gotten smaller, but they are just disappearing in my hands. Really, really good stuff. I'm gonna go in on the last bite. Big bite of the bacon uh, Philly cheesesteak burger here at Checkers. In Hickory, North Khaki Lackey. <laughs> mm. God. So on the bacon and crispy mushroom steak burger here at Checkers, I'm going to have to go ahead and just rate that a 7. I thought it was a pretty good burger. I think that the uh, little crispy mushroom should have been crispy like a french fry. Packed a super huge flavor though. I thought they were good. And of course, got to mark it down a little bit because they didn't put the bacon on. I had to steal the bacon from the other burger, but it was still good nonetheless. On the bacon and Philly cheese steak burger here at Checkers. Now that one also, I'm going to just go ahead and give that a 7 as well. Frankly, because it tasted exactly like the first one. Maybe not as zesty or as spicy because it was missing those mushrooms. But the burgers are assembled absolutely the same so of course they're going to taste the same i would just upgrade and get the mushrooms even if you don't like mushrooms just the flavor alone of those little uh crispy mushrooms as they call it they're batter dipped batter fried and they're seasoned just like their french fries here so it's definitely an experience you want to check out i think it's fantastic you could coat anything in their batter dipped seasoned french fry mix and it would taste great. I hope you all enjoyed another fast food review here on Fast Food Pit Stops. I'm your host, Justin. You know you love it. You came back for more of it. I'll be back for another fast food review. Bye, everybody. Here on an all new fast food. Waiting for the order at the window. Let's go. Oh no. Forgot the bacon once again.